there, netizens of the humankind race, and welcome to the next sewage explosion, chainsaw massacre, and bloody vessel bursting episode of Stunning! In our last episode, Eve has started off very epically on her next working hour of her hunting trip by being stalked and nearly bifurcated by a horrific genetic freakish beast known as the Stalker, which had a literal bio-organic revving chainsaw belt with bony incisors for a head. Kind of like the devil Denji from the anime show Chainsaw Man, or those weird extinct helicoprion fish that look like someone planted a default circular saw blade onto the lower jaws of a shark. During the fight against the blind yet olfactory sensitive beast, Eve was putting her adept matrix dodging and her own stalker blink to its fullest use, evading almost all of the rip sawing Helios Copreon's murderous face ripping attacks, and even held herself tight during a frictional heated chainsaw versus katana to the death duel, always emerging victorious against the rage inside a horror machine. In the end, Eve mercilessly put an end to its teeth grinding by tapping into its spinal cord to kick the stalker off the top of the alien food chain. After harvesting the brain core from the chainsaw mole man, Eve suddenly gained a new burst ability, which unlocks new alternative and yet more powerful blade techniques, such as a tempest storm of luminescent razor crystal glass wire, a neural maximum overdrive that allows Eve to move fast like a twitcher on cocaine, and an impact attack that is explosively powerful as a howitzer cannon shell. As a result of the bloody fight that sent us off the rails at the yard though, we had to use the station's car washing system to clean off the alien blood off the side of the train, conveniently also named E, thus revealing the code to the entrance into the sewers where our elusive Nikiba was hiding. At first, Eve was not in the mood of diving deep into the shitty cesspool water again as she does not want the filth to ruin her princess bob cut hair. But she suddenly had a change of heart and a massive migraine when she sensed that Akiba has successfully hacked into the Hell's Angel Diver's secret psychic comms, and in a twist of irony, sensed it that Angel's upcoming movements way before Lily could detect them, Alpha and Akiba's pheromone presence. If any further delays would allow more opportunities for the Nikiba to gather more of our covert intelligence and possibly also collect on private, embarrassingly lewd moments from other angels during their bath or shower time, E bravely head into the sewer maintenance tunnels full of mind controlling octopi, malarking locusts, fresh eating meat honey hatcheries, and muddy dangerous mites as we trudge and swim our way past the rotten decomposing detritus and sewage filtering once more towards our next underground target. Well, that is, if they have not seen us coming yet via hacking suck and finding the drama. Alright, then. Now, I just start by over here. I can remember correctly, uh, we were, uh, we were, were we heading up or heading down? Yeah, definitely heading up. Yeah, yeah. is it? Hmm. Alright, okay, so we stopped over there, I went down this ladder, right into the elusive, like, a treasure chest before we were ambushed by that top, that scully that overtook that dead corpse. But fortunately, I managed to warn her because I was always watching behind her ass. You know, unlike freaking Adam here who always seems to stare at her ass instead of behind it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we're working with perverted children here. Anyway. We really went down here, right? Oh, we're gonna go around here. We really got this chest. And then. Did we already have the fusion shell this whole time? Let me check. Yes, that's we have! I hear rumbling. Uh oh. Oh, it's so good. Uh, okay, it was the activation tool. Okay, okay. I can feel warmth from this place. Oh, that means someone's living over there. And it seems that the heaters are operating on like a fusion battery there. Ooh, that's a very nice warm mix they got here. I wonder if they have a piano. Alright, let's investigate. The owner's advice. What kind of place is it outside? It's dark. Everything is there except for a monster. This is the city of survivors does not exist. It's all a fairy tale that comes made up to be difficult to the children like me. A 
Oh no, it reminds me of the guy that we did on the Metro last night where all the kids have been living in the subway for like their whole entire lives and they never you know what the outside world used to look like before the nuclear bomb shot dropped other than a few postcards they sit onto the walls in fact, they never even know what a Tata bird or a giraffe or an elephant even looks like all the animals they only know are a freaking mutated monster that used to roam around inside of that subway <laughs> It's very both amazing and incredibly sad to say so. Uh, what was everyone meant to say in a place like this? Survival, duh. All I know is that we're the only ones here right now. Yeah, so I think we're invading their very private spots, man. But then again, they were bearing all of that, and I guess they wouldn't mind right now. Because, you know, they're possibly all dead already. And it's over to Oh, it's a shortcut. Ah, crap! I am not very good at her pet shack. Yeah. Is there a cat nearby? Ooh, what's this? It's a radio! Or an iPad device, it's on the other radio. What is it? Credits! The small lion that was below my feet dipped it into a large crack that swallowed me all on oh, no, St. Paul. It was lost, but its spirit was gone. I knew that I would never be able to see it again. A doll, a guitar, a kid, a small dinner party, even air, water, and the network traffic. And all the life before says is that I thought I lost so many years ago. I can no longer desire any of it anymore. All of these have been taken by the darkness. What's the purpose of my life anymore? What do I have to believe in? Oh no, what a spirit like literally stuffed out the cotton. Fire underneath you face the ass and now he's got nothing left and he probably like forgetting to self cancel himself. And we realize that he cannot live in a world full of time and illegal aliens. Well, at least he got this teddy there, so. But yeah, we can't. We can't really. Our first one, you're not even on yet. Unless you're Wilson the volleyball. Ah, looks like we need a few things to really focus up here. And yeah, let's continue on slow. Ooh, what's this? Hmm, interesting. Ah, okay, I don't want to go in here because it looks like a testing material here. Okay, let's continue exploring over here. Let's see if there's anything, anything back there. Alright, I'll be going to do this. Wondering how they could have survived being locked up without any human flesh to feast on. Stay out of this, Lily. Oh, former friends of yours, huh? All right, just open up and get the extra spy, okay? Bring a chance, huh? <laughs> and he's my special improving beta skills. Ooh, okay. All right, let's check it out. Bring a chance, extra spy, okay? Increase beta energy recharge by 12%. Extra spy precise in improving beta skills. Chance stars, quantum semiconductors, unfortunately, have very poor yields. Exospine modules were expensive, so their quantity was limited. However, thanks to its marketing as a luxury item, they were able to build an image of an expansion device that differs from gear modules. Now this here is an example of what professors in microeconomics call the snob effect. 
Because there is not much public demand for pricey quantum semiconductors, it ironically creates what is known as negative network externality, meaning that it generates a growing consumer market of rich influential transmitters who would want to buy something uniquely innovative and sensational to their own preferential liking. It's not uncommon for firms of the oligopoly to artificially vertically skew the demand curve so that it can further bark up the selling prices of their expensive products without affecting consumer demand. As rich on this Medium article by John Wade, tech companies, for example, precisely advertise their products as snob goods by emphasizing the preciousness and limited human lifetime as an allure. By purchasing their expensive advanced AI tech for their business, high-income buyers like AI-dominated services or computer-controlled factory lines can have the luxury of simultaneity and efficiency in work performance, thereby saving a lot of time for consumers to focus more on leisurely and recreational activities as the machines do the work. Perhaps as a bonus, Chechastar could also highlight the benefits over regular semiconductors, or pay for social media endorsements to tech-savvy influencers to help sell the brand of their pricey yet nerve-wracking quantum semiconductors. Next up is the emotional regulation chip from Lockheed Martin. I was kind of skeptical about this one at first, but then I found out it was made for soldiers who needed to kill Iraqi children without remorse. It has Bluetooth 5.2, a Snapdragon 480 Plus, and lets you delete your humanity by becoming a scary robot person with only one vocal tone and facial expression. Huh, that's weird. I don't feel any different. What a waste of 3.2 million dollars. Luckily, this video is sponsored. As the wise Greek philosopher Theophrastus once said, time is the most luxurious treasure that humans cannot afford. Hmm. Well, I have been using the video, but I still love the reflex type exos glasses. It allows me to like touch very perfectly and also parry perfectly, so I won't have to worry about the timing. I think I'll still keep this. Yeah. I'll wait until I, you know, expand my exos glasses. Hmm. Okay, I think we're done here. Alright, time to head towards the, uh, reading Oh, I think there's medicine nearby. Yes, we're very close to the medicine. Just as I thought, groups of survivors were settled here. Oh, there's like a over market. This place has been abandoned for a long time. Oh, man. Why do I feel good? It's probably like a stench of running up to your nose. Yeah. It could also be that there are still heat pumps tapping energy from the decomposition of the sewers below. Ooh, hey, I'm gonna see the medicine! That's right! The medicine for some disease. Yes, we can probably carry that white screw cheese! Alright! Alright, let's not count the bulletin board now, because I still got all this stuff. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, it's gonna be more classic hearts than fan fiction? Oh, Z's diary, ooh! It's already been seven years since I came here from the monsters. Oh my god, fucking seven years! Why are you even bringing heat, man? How do you bring it survive against God? I had that for a second. Fuck your sanctuary. This place is no longer safe, but there's nowhere else to go. We're going to end up dying here. I heard a rumor about a city where survivors are hiding. If only I can go there. Um, I don't care if I'm called an idiot. But if even a single shard of the old world still exists out there, I have to find it. Between endless years of hopeless existence and even a single moment of hope, I must choose hope. I must find that signal. Religiously fanatic conceptual in his city, where you take you know, oppression and lock bitches nutbags so or be massacred by God and illegal aliens. Ooh, oh, look at that! Christmas lights here, huh? Oh, no, it's a big deal. Christmas lights. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and open this door. Alright, let's see what's going on in here. Oh, 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 Shotgun. 
Oh, it's not hiding. Okay. Hmm. Okay, this is another so called bedroom, I guess. <laughs> Woo! A guitar! Ooh, hey, let's open it. Let's see what we got. Ah, of course it is. Oh, oh, yes, yeah, we got the passcodes. Uh, Lambda, Beta, uh, well, what is it? Kappa, Beta, Delta, Beta. Beta, Delta, Beta. Okay, just to be. Ooh, what do we have here? Can you play? Let's call the guitar. Uh, oh yeah, I can play Metro 23 feet. Do this thing. <laughs> oh, and I was to leave the aborted and a green dark move. I'm literally inside a dark bitch. Joe will be surrounded by God and aliens, you know? Well, I don't exactly play guitar, but my uh, brother used to take the guitar lessons back when he was a teenager, but then he also got disinterested as well. What? what? No, that's a wine bar. It felt alcohol or moonshine. AKA the Greek god of winemaking, orchids, fruitiness, and getting crunked up and partying all night like a sex animal. It's why the ancient Greeks used bakia as a term for drunken craziness and hijinks. Hmm. I wonder if it's still a little drinkable here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, it's still too much more. <laughs> what the hell did I do that? Oh, yes. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, oh, piano! Yeah, finally! Yeah, yeah! Play it! I can be ready to show off my skills. Yes. Yeah. Music was an invaluable source of comfort for people here. And a uh, weapon against war. Oh, in fact, I think I have uh, this uh, song ready in my head right now, guys. How does it go again? Oh, yes, uh, I remember now. <laughs> You do pay yeah, okay? I'm not bullshitting you, right, guys? Okay? There may be more to come uh, later on if we find any more of the animals to play. So. Alright, let's see what we got. Ooh! We got two dollars. Here we go. Woohoo! Yay! Ooh, a bug bag! I think someone slept here. Yeah, of course. It's not a good place for sweet dreams. Yeah, <laughs> 9 times out of 10, you're most likely to get poor into nightmares of being raped by monsters. Or having seen your families and friends being raped by monsters. <laughs> but then again, it's still way better than sitting on the concrete floor. That's something up her buddy! <laughs> Not funny. See, it's funny. No need to fear death! Death is just the beginning of a journey to become one who put a spear! Yes! It's a little bow! Wait, we're left to die on Earth! There's no journey after that! When we die, death die! Quite the novelist you are, eh, fella? <laughs> yeah, I'll be, you're probably losing if I live on your job for that time, Mom. Ooh, Ooh, it's a post-it no boss. These fellows, where did Mother Spears Grace go? Lies! 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 Uh, I guess you better uh, look after that, because uh, 
There's uh, not too much posted on this uh, cork board. Hey, let's check out top video. Hmm. Ooh, yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. it's a lot of uh, stride video. Ooh, and there's even a vending machine over here. Oh, that could be the cat. What? I can't believe it still works after all these years. It's like 70 years precisely. Huh. You still have this focus, but not. <laughs> At least that still hasn't gone away. I've heard the people that. <sighs> still refreshing. Alright, I guess we'll uh, maybe take a little break over here. Decent and respectful for a wastewater plant He's still funeral. The salvation Mother Sphere promised them. They chose to devote their whole lives praying for the goddess instead of seeking refuge in Zion. Instead, they end up being taken away by the tentacles of alien hell. I want to send the memories left here to Mother Sphere. That's where they belong. Mm. Oh, oh, is that Brock? From Brock? Oh, yeah, take your memories. Thank okay, you. Let's take all the memories you can uh, take it through the. Uh, Bring Kayo. Ooh! Oh, look at the USB stick storing the glass jar. Alright, let's hack it in and like uh, store it on our times. So, uh, so many memories. Uh, oh, okay, that's where the one was coming from. <laughs> from the candle. Okay. Yeah, those must be busy who was the die will really down with ready for uh, what is your salvation. Ah! They all fell. Oh, okay, there's a joke speech. We struggle so hard to survive. Even when our family, our friends die. We fought about giving in. We can now see the end in sight. We are exhausted. Our will is to fight is all gone. Now it is time to end this pain. This sorrow, this despair. Uh, oh, and Jake's speech. Okay, no, I'm hard to say this. Yeah. You can rest easy now, Jake. The ends will not be here hurting you anymore. Who what do you have over here? Oh, yes, yes, well, I'll open up this door. Alright, okay, uh, let's head back. Okay, so open this up. Oh, wait, there's a new team of the hot. Okay, so probably the lookout for this, okay? And also, watch out for any of these uh, technical stuff. Okay, that's a new team. 
is over, I'm going to raise your voice an octave. Yes, sir, in fact, 
Miyamara. He resides both from both his job and his life. Let's get him one worse down that dog. Ah, you know how to play. This is how we operate the land. Oh, I hate things like this. Oh, I hate fucking surprises. Hey, video games? Yeah. Big summer toes well, okay? And then freaking horrors always come to freaking freeze, guys. Ah, look at all these dead bodies over here. There's like a really potential, like a skull fucker, really uh, buffet over here, guy. We might be taking the horse there, so yeah. Oh, what's that? Uh, okay, uh. Alright! Okay, it's over this side. Let's see what we got. Fire! Oh! Let's 
to set up a few landmines around you today, but in case the skies can be over here and, uh, and try to fuck us over. Ha <laughs> It's time for Rock to turn to give him a Nazi surprise. Yeah. Let's try the study. And the sky gets over here pretty close to him. We'll throw it in, right? Easy peasy. Gasoline squeezy. Alright, students. Let's uh, fun house level begin. Yeah, Fowler. Keep an eye for the skies! <laughs> oh, we're getting close to the hot guys! Oh, Jesus Christ! Ah, shit! Yeah, 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 Is it just for help? Kill me! Oh no! Oh, it is like a 
sends us for hell to be put out of misery. Oh, Jesus Christ. We'll find out more once we get to the source of the contamination. You don't think you can keep uh, uh, actually taking over the angel's with brain and like literally using it as a gap puppet? That's like uh, how the freaking skullings use the other workers as a puppet, right? I think I know what that message is. Well, there be fully prepared, guys. You're gonna be like, oh, oh yes, I'm gonna tell you guys. Do it. I lied. Time for rechargeable temporary increase from five to six. Okay, let's see. Let's check out the new suits. Gail, you guys. Oh, oh, yeah. So tacky. Church of Star CNG is here for you. A casual master outfit from the daily collection that makes you feel more friendly, comfortable, and confident. And also, Chadley Sexy. Daily Force. Check the star CD, is it for you? I can't remember it. Okay, this is the yeah, same message, okay? Just different outfit. Uh, let's let's work on the drone. Upgrade drone scan, I'll go down as a DP by first. Oh yes, the upgrade drone. Oh, kind of jack jack! Hey, 
about to have her own power back. Okay, okay, stop, stop, okay. Oh, 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 Juggernaut, bitch! You ready on some of our body, an unbreakable baby boy? Kick ass! Juggernaut, baby! That was close. No, this is close. You'll be too close to rats, Adam. Juggernaut, guns normally can be endlessly over prey, but in special cases, multiple ones can contaminate its new course. The resulting Nikima is not just a simple puppet, but a hideous swollen monster. The monster craves death as it wields the weapon it used in life, now enhanced with the power of nature bonds. Juggernauts are unexpectedly violent and quick, rather than slow and clumsy. Do not take them lightly. Juggernauts use their huge, extremely powerful bodies to release shockwaves, act quickly to avoid getting flung away. When a juggernaut is enraged, its giant hammer bursts into flames, posing an extra and significant threat. He thinks he's the biggest bass of all time, but in reality, he's just a rippiest bitch who has been in Trump castrated and penetrated. <laughs> he can't be, he's a freaking master of the cheap iron pilots. That's it. Oh, what the hell are we got? But not tough enough, apparently. Not even a single scratch. <laughs> well, I don't want to continue, but I think we're like over to one hour in the sky. 45 minutes if you count for any kind of stuff. I'll take uh, a uh, rest over here before she uh, can continue on to the next mission. So, uh, just remember, folks, you don't have to like, you don't have to comment, and you do not even have to subscribe. But if you still want to follow me, Adam, Lily, and the rest of our Salva Genius King Dad, and so look for the elusive uh, Alpha Nativa, will we? Go on, uh, crush the rest of the other minions, and also uh, take care of the Nichiba's bitches, then uh, go on right ahead. This is Young Master Z, signing off. Until next time, so long!